exploring the pros and cons of the hipster haven called West Asheville. I had to wear my disco shirt for this one. West Asheville has gained a reputation as a hipster haven. This vibrant area offers a unique blend of trendy shops, eclectic entertainment, and a strong sense of community. However, like another, any other place on earth, there are pros and cons to consider before making a decision to make West Asheville your home. So let's delve into the advantages and disadvantages of living in this trendy part of Asheville and see if it's right for you. Hi, I'm Beth Shadler and we are Living in Asheville, Disco Version, where we explore what it's like to live, eat, work, sleep, play in Asheville, North Carolina and the surrounding mountain towns. I'm a realtor here in Asheville and it's my absolute passion and pleasure to help people explore the idea of moving to the area. And we get emails and texts every day from people who are making their plan, envisioning their dream. So feel free to reach out to us any old time and we'd be glad to help walk you through the process of how it could work for you. And if you'd like to learn more about Asheville in general, push that little bell, hit the subscribe button so that you'll be alerted every time we make a new video that you probably already want to see. So every place has an upside and a downside and West Asheville is no exception. So let's jump into reasons you may not want to live in West Asheville. Con number one, the housing costs. One of the downsides of living in West Asheville is the relatively high cost of housing compared to the square footage that you actually invest in. Uh, most homes are older arts and crafts style homes and they just didn't need as much space back then, which kind of makes you want to reflect on that. Um, and these are really charming older homes and there's no lack of character, of course, because they're older. So if this is less important for you, like to have a ton of living space and more important for you to have a higher quality of life and entertainment, it would suit you well to dwell Haha, uh -huh, in West Asheville. Con number two, traffic challenges. With its growing popularity, West Asheville faces some congestion every once in a while, especially when considering the three main points of access to West Asheville are Pat Nav, Downtown, and 240, which are all quite busy places. Navigating through these busy routes can sometimes be frustrating and add a little bit of extra time on your daily commute if you have one of those. And with more and more remote workers, traffic has let up a little bit, but it's still noticeable. Con number three, it's quirky and unpredictable to say the least. West Asheville prides itself on embracing its strangeness and weirdness and wonderfulness. While this can be appealing to some, it can also create an unpredictable and sometimes uncomfortable environment for others. So keep that in mind. The neighborhood's unique character may introduce encounters with peculiar individuals and unusual events that may not suit everyone's taste. Weird things happen. One may encounter strangers on strange trips and the party might get a little lifted sometimes. Con number four, the high cost of living in West Asheville's vibrant social scene and dang good time can come at a price. The abundance of dining options, the live music venues, the trendy cafes may tempt you to indulge in dining out and rocking out frequently. I know it would be a little tempting for me. So that can strain your bank account balance. And I know at the end of a long day, it's so much easier to order some takeout from the delicious restaurant next door than to figure out what the heck you're going to make that night. I know my fridge would be totally bare bones if I lived in West Asheville. Con number five, limited space to stretch. One notable con of living in West Asheville is a limited yard space available to the high demand and population density. Everybody wants to be there and if there was an extra lot before, it's now sold and they're building something. So as the neighborhood's popularity has grown over the years, the available open lots have become scarce, resulting in smaller yards compared to other areas. This limitation can be a downside for individuals who really value their outdoor space for gardening or recreation or just vastness or playgrounds or whatnot. So if you tend to feel kind of cramped, you might want to go a little bit farther out. Additionally, those with children or pets may want a little bit more space as well. And properties may lack the lush greenery 
scenery and landscaping commonly associated with larger yards on the other sides of town. However, it's worth noting that West Asheville compensates for the limitation by offering an abundance of nearby amenities, such as outdoor greenways and the French Broad River, where residents can still enjoy nature and outdoor activities while having all the fun of West Asheville right at their fingertips. So enough with all the doom and gloom, and let's check out the pros of living in West Asheville. There are plenty of them, so let's dive right in. Pro number one, it's a really trendy, fun place. One of the most significant advantages of living in West Asheville is its atmosphere. And Haywood Road, the neighborhood has a really rich history of being a hub for alternative and counterculture movements. From the origins of coolness with like cut off jeans and thin hats, to embrace all the types of people. West Asheville attracts individuals seeking an alternative and unconventional lifestyle. And if you enjoy being a part of a creative, open, freedom-seeking community, this neighborhood will feel like a coming home. Pro number two, the abundance of entertainment options. West Asheville is teeming with great food and music and art and cool people, especially along that main strip again called Haywood Road. The street is filled with a wide array of dining places and from upscale upscale eateries to like food trucks to anything you could imagine. Global cuisine, farm to table, there's an oyster house. So there's something to satisfy every palate. You could eat at the walk or get a beer on tap at a gas station or go to open mic night at Westville Pub or catch some Kirtan at Iruprana Listening Room. The energetic social scene ensures that there is something for everyone and it's typically pretty exciting and fun. Pro number three, it's walkable and the convenience from being able to walk from your little oasis of home to the excitement of Haywood Road is awesome. Living in West Ash offers the convenience of a walkable neighborhood and it really all revolves around that main hub and that stretch between Patton Ave and the river is where you can find all the shops and boutiques and local businesses explore the area on foot take a trip here and just walk around and see how it feels to you immerse yourself in the neighborhood's community talk to some locals support some local shops and cafes you can walk to see live music or walk to dinner and back or a quick shopping trip to Wingles. That's the Ingles grocery store in West Asheville. We always put the name of the area in front of it for some reason. Oh, yeah. Oh, and West Asheville has an Aldi. There, that did it, didn't it? Pro number four, abundant amenities and outdoor spaces. So you might not have all the outdoor spaces at home, but like I mentioned, they're all around. So go somewhere like Carrier Park, right along the French Broad River. And there's activities like cycling and jogging and picnicking and yoga in the park. And you can even float on the French Broad River on a sunny day. I just checked the website and the latest water quality test, maybe before I dip my tush in there. The nearby River Arts District houses the vibrant art scene of Asheville and an industrial atmosphere. And it's really, really close. So that allows residents to explore galleries and studios speckled with graffiti. You probably want to get your picture made in front of or be influenced by because it's really quite cool. For fitness fanatics, the French Broad River Greenway provides an opportunity to reconnect with your inner Jane Fonda or push a baby stroller and you'll see walkers and runners and rollerbladers spinning around and it's just always interesting. If you want to learn more about all parts of Asheville, hit that subscribe button and click that little bell so that you can be alerted every time we make a new video for you. And let us know in the comments what we missed or what you'd like to see us make a video about next time. We're taking requests. Living in West Asheville offers a vibrant and trendy lifestyle with an abundance of entertainment options. A strong sense of community and it's convenient to almost everything. However, it's important to weigh these advantages against potential drawbacks, such as higher housing costs, maybe some traffic problems, or the quirky atmosphere. Wait, is that a drawback? Ultimately, your decision to make West Asheville your home will depend on your personal preferences, of course. How long is your beard? By considering the pros and cons outlined in this video, you can make an informed choice that aligns with your lifestyle and aspirations, or seek a more subdued living experience, uh, maybe in another part of town. Because West Asheville offers a unique neighborhood with a distinct charm I wouldn't want to miss. Until then, enjoy it all and ciao for now. Music